big containers a creamy jiff eight dollars and twelve cents this this is one heck of a bargain here look at how much you get I mean why go to the other stores when you can get a deal like this I mean this is how we have to save money I mean I'm tired of going to the expensive stores and buying stuff because things are just getting crazy this is the way to shop I mean eight dollars holy cow holy smolies <laughs> all the Ziplocs are on sale one gallon Ziploc storage bags look at you get 208 of them in here for $16 regular $18.98 you get 216 of these freezer bags $12 that's a bargain right there, no doubt about it. Holy cow! I think this is the cheapest I've seen it at Sam's. Whole wings, a dollar ninety-eight. Very nice, and there's a lot of them. Look, look at all the wings and the chicken legs. Ninety-eight cents a pound. This is good. This is good right here. This is why I'm not shopping at those other supermarkets. Just come to the bulk stores, Sam's and Costco. These are my favorite. I don't have to drive to Orlando. White Castle cheeseburgers, my favorite. <laughs> love these guys. I just love these guys. Oh man, I tell you what, I don't know why. They're just addicting. Well, today we're going to Sam's. It's the Saturday before before New Year's 2023, and uh, we're shopping for bargains. I'm tired of getting ripped off at these stores. I saw six dollar Oreo cookies, twelve dollar eggs at Whole Foods yesterday. I'm tired of that. We're heading into Sam's. Let's go. There we go, Sam's Club, home of bargains. We're in Sam's here early in the morning and uh, we have to get through this because of, uh, it's gonna be packed today. <laughs> Anyways, you know, uh, here's another thing is, some of these I wanna show everybody are these, these air filters. You don't think a lot of it, but, uh, and let's check these out. These are a four pack of these air filters right here, $39. I think this is extremely high. I go to Home Depot, get them for 11 and they went up. But $39.98, 18 by 24, this is my size, but these are the ones that catch all the bacteria, fill treat. So you're talking $10 for each one of these. I think these are high. I, I, I know they're really nice, these, uh, these air filters like this, but this is expensive. I mean, $40, and they're on sale for air filters. Even at Sam's, I think this is high. These are really high quality, but I change them. Sometimes every two to three weeks in Florida, you have to because of all the uh, the dust in the air and the pollen. And with the air conditioners running 24 seven, even throw in the cold. But anyways, 40 bucks, <laughs> that's expensive. Even even the little size right here, 16 by 20 for the guys, $39. That's very pricey. Oh, here's some, here's some smaller ones, 12 by 12. That's gotta be a small, uh, um, a unit and they're still $39 for these guys. Look at that. Look at my hand. <laughs> I wanted to check out some ground beef. I was tired of paying $6.99. Look at this 93% members ground beef like this, but you got to buy it in uh, three pounds, but that's okay. That's really good right here. Look at that. I have to get some beef. That's a really good price right there. Oh, look at this. I found some Wagyu, American Wagyu. 588 a pound ground beef and this isn't bad either maybe I should try this but I'm gonna buy some hamburger today and bison's always good too look at 1999 for 85% lean bison and you get this is two and a half pounds so that's not bad either I don't know which one I'm gonna get this is 498 a pound but grass-fed 85% lean this isn't bad either 1650 for this but you know, sixteen fifty. Maybe I should try some of this. This might be good. Uh, maybe I should try it. I'm gonna buy one of these. I haven't determined which one I'm gonna get, but this looks really appealing. Just that word, you know. I could say, "Hey, add some wagyu." <laughs> but my wife told me to look for some salmon today because bring in the new year with some salmon. And oh, those are two pieces, thirty-seven dollars. It's twelve forty-eight a pound for the sockeye. I just want one piece, one affordable piece of salmon. If I could find it. Let me see here. Oh, here's some steelhead trout fillets. Steelhead trout. $8.98 a pound. $15.09. I don't know. Oh, this farm raised. I want to get some wild. See, there's wild caught right there. And then you have farm raised. $8.98 a pound, though. And this is, that's farm raised as well. I don't see any of the, oh, this is all farm raised, too. Farm raised here. That's too much. I'm not, I don't need that much. None of the other fish I want to get. 
I do like the cod prices, $8.98 a pound. This is really good too. Wild caught. I always look for that wild caught Pacific cod. If I could find one fish here, $24. Oh, here's a $22 one. I gotta look at the dates though. Used by 1717. This looks pretty good here. I really like wild caught. Oh, $17. This looks good. We're getting better here. Used by 171248 a pound. This looks really good. Sockeye salmon filet. This is really delicious. I'm gonna put this in the cart right here. That's what we're gonna get right there. Bring in the new year. Celebrate with some sockeye. Look at that. See? The wild caught like that sockeye and then the steelhead trout fillet farmed i don't want that because they feed it i don't know what i've always heard about the food they feed them to give it the coloration this is natural color right here i like that that's a really good deal right there so salmon for dinner tomorrow and here's tilapia 598 but it, it's farm raised right here see that 598 a pound farm raised well here's some nice ahi tuna and it's, it's wild caught. This is really good, wild caught. $21.98, $10.98 a pound. Does that look beautiful? Look at this. They're really vacuum sealed. They do a good job on that, but this is really nice. We should try that. You just pepper it up and uh, fry it in the pan, medium rare. Oh, with some wasabi. That's delicious right there. Now, here's one of my favorites right here. Boneless pork loin chops. Fresh, never frozen, $2.48 a pound, $6.55 for this. Look at this. There's almost three pounds in here. It, I always like to look for the darker colors here because they're just more, much more tender. This is a good price right here. I like this. Even the pork tenderloins here, what a deal. Four pounds, $2.98 a pound for these guys. That's really good. Then your regular pork chops here, $2.68 a pound, bone in. And look at this, pork loin chops assorted, $1.98 a pound. Look at this right here. These look really nice, don't they? Look at all that they have right here. This is really good price. Why go to the other expensive supermarkets? We know what the names of them are, but you'd never find a deal like this. And you'd never find a deal like this pork. Not at all. $2.48 a pound. And look at this, just for $6.55, you get this, $6.25. This is a deal right here. I'm putting one of these in the basket, too. Why not, you know? That's a really good deal. Oh, I, I got my lens wipes and some nice Members Mark dryer sheets here for $6. Look at this! <laughs> yep, we're filling the cart up today. Vegetables are next. Eight pounds of navel oranges here. Look at this. 8 856 California navels and these look fantastic. These look great. Look at this. They look great, don't they? 850 856 for these guys. That's a bargain. Try and get that at a regular grocery store. In in the uh, mandarins right here. They're always pricey, but 672. Oh, look at these guys. They wouldn't last the weekend with me. Oh man. But we're looking for potatoes today. Yeah, uh, Cara Cara navels. I don't know what those are. I think I've heard of these, and they're really good. From what I, my wife told me about these, eight 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 thirty four for these. I bet they're delicious. Lemons three pounds for four eighteen. What a deal! What a deal! Look at that, and they're nice looking too. Limes three pounds of limes three seventy seven. Look at that. The, the Sam's, the home of bargains right there. What a deal. Here's 10 pounds of bacon potatoes, $6.98. And look at the size of these. These are the biggest potatoes. Look at this. This is the biggest potato I've ever seen. Look at that. My gosh, these are monsters. I like this and I love potatoes. It, it's such a good food for you. It's so affordable. Look at that. I think these are the, it says Idaho, I believe, so. I'm, I think I'm going to get a bag of these right here for $6.98. You can't beat it. Some bread potatoes, $6.46. I really like these, 10 pounds of them from North Carolina. Product of USA Premium Red Potatoes, and I love red potatoes too. This isn't a bad price at all for these guys. Look at that. Oh my gosh. Red potatoes are so good. Then I leave the skins on when I boil them like this. 
These look really good. I'm gonna get a bag of these right here. This looks really good. This is gonna go in here. My wife told me to get water too, so I have to make room, but that's really good right there. Nice, nice potatoes. Look at the size of this pie, 1098 for this pie. Four pound pie, apple, well, apple lattice pie, 12 inches. 1098, look at the size of this guy. Holy smolies, oh my gosh. Look at the size of that. Now that's one heck of a pie right there. I really like, look at their cookies, 674. Try and get that somewhere for these cookies here. Man, really good deal. All their muffins over there, but really nice chocolate chip cookies, 598 for all these. That's a bargain right there. Look at multi-grain croissants, 598. Look at these. They look good and these little guys right here. I like these cocktail croissants. 20 of them, 5.98. Oh man, these are just delicious. Just love those things. Look at the assorted muffins, 6.74 for all those muffins and the blueberry muffins. I bought a package of these. They lasted two days. <laughs> That's all they did. Are these cranberry red velvet muffins, 4.48? My gosh. That looks really good right there. Oh, here's their seedless watermelon. I don't know why it's $9.98 just for one of these. I don't get it. I don't get what the price is on watermelons. Honeycrisp apples, $8.18 for four pounds of them. Four pounds of Honeycrisp for $8.18. You go to another store, I've seen them for $6 a pound. And commonly you see them $3 a pound, but $8.18 for four pounds of them, that's, that's $2 a pound. <laughs> I'm trying to do my math. <laughs> Cantaloupes, 248 right here. 248 for these guys. Very nice. Nice cantaloupes right there. Apple pears. I've never had an apple pear. I don't know what they're like, but they're they're ten dollars for six of them. And the mangoes are 8.5 pounds, 717. So this is really good here. Product of Ecuador. This is look at how look at how big these are. That's really nice. Oh, I tell you, my wife loves these. I'll have to show her the 717 though for, for that right there. And you get two, four, six, seven of them, how big they are. Look at that. You know, I've decided to go with the 93% ground beef. You see it? Yeah. I'm getting this. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, this is a good deal right here. All natural, minimally processed, no artificial ingredients, 478 a pound, no additives, product USA. Freezer uh, ready pack. Always fresh, never frozen. This is a good deal. I'm going to get some of this. Look at the dates, 113. I think I'll get this one here, $14 for three pounds of beef. That's a bargain right there. My shopping cart's filling up with this stuff. Lots of bargains today. Well, here's the chicken tenderloins. Let's get it right now. That's the weight. That's per pound, 388 a pound for the chicken tenderloins. Thighs. Skinless, boneless, three forty-eight a pound. Ooh, chickens going up. Chicken breast, two sixty-eight a pound. Boneless, skinless. That's better. That's better than the thighs. But I like the thighs. Skin on, a dollar thirty-eight. You know what? I like this. I'll just tear the skin off. <laughs> That's the way to go. And here's some of these farmers market, three eighty-eight a pound chicken breast. I don't know. I think I'll stick. I'll think I'll stick with the chicken thighs right there. That's a good price. Seven forty-four for over five pounds of it. That's a that's a good deal there. Boston pork butt, dollar ninety-eight a pound. You get fifteen and a half pounds for thirty dollars. You get two of them in here. I tell you, for having a party or a smoker, or a big family, this is the way to shop. This is how you save money right there. Pork spare ribs, two forty-eight a pound. Yep, what a bargain right here. Look at this. You get two slabs for $19.94. Look at that. This is nice right here. If you have a smoker, this is the way to go or a barbecue. That's how you save money here. Let's look at the whole wings. $1.98 for whole wings. That's the cheapest I've seen in a long time for, for chicken wings. $1.98. No antibiotics ever. Chicken wings, $1.98. That's a bargain right there. I like this. Holy cow. I think this is the cheapest I've seen it at Sam's. Whole wings, $1.98. Very nice. And there's a lot of them. Look. Look at all the wings and the chicken legs. 98 cents a pound. This is good. 
this is good right here this is why I'm not shopping at those other supermarkets just come to the bulk stores Sam's and Costco okay you know I have to check the eggs here because we don't have any at home Grade A large Eggland best. I, that's not a bargain. Six twenty-eight for eighteen. And there's no way that's a bargain. And you have to buy twenty-four of them. I told my wife twenty-four eggs we have to eat for eight thirty-eight. And here it is. I don't know if I want to buy all of these. I don't know if we're going to eat twenty-four eggs before the expiration date. But that's if you want to save money. There you go. Four four uh, four eighteen for. Uh, for a dozen of them if you want to if you buy 24 so I mean they're still affordable here at Sam's and organic cage-free brown large eggs good deal right there you know I wanted to find some uh, they call them waffle fries but I wanted to find some crinkle cut fries but I don't need I don't need a big box of these 30 pounds for $26 you get six five pound bags I don't need this many fries I mean I need a, a bag like this maybe maybe but four pounds for 748 and I already have the potatoes but look at this 748 this is like what you'd find at um, a chick-fil-a but you know the way that they make them is I'm sure is a lot different but that's not bad right there but look at this if you want to get these um, oh those are straight cut where's the um, I thought they were crinkle cut but $26 for 30 pounds of fries holy smolies and you know what I'm, I'm low on cheese slices 826 and uh, this isn't bad for 72 slices of this craft and I like this I know there's you get 96 slices for 10 or 11 dollars at Costco I think it averages out but that's still a good deal and I need some of these because I'm a grilled cheese kind of guy anyways you can go over there guys sit over there I like that Oh, you know, I can't I can't leave Sam's without showing you my, my White Castle cheeseburgers. <laughs> Look at these. These guys are just delicious. $11.98, and you get 18 sliders, and I don't have to drive all the way to Orlando. Oh, these are my favorite. I don't have to drive to Orlando. White Castle cheeseburgers are my favorite. <laughs> I love these guys. I just love these guys. Oh, man, I tell you what. I don't know why. They're just addicting. Lasagna with meat sauce. 96 ounces, 13.48. That's six pounds of lasagna with meat sauce. This is a deal right here. I tell you what, look at this. Look how thick that is. Six pounds of it. It take you an hour and a half to cook it, but oh, that would last several days with lunches, you know. And that's really good. I really like Stouffer's. Just put some Parmesan on there with some uh, olive oil, a little bit of oregano. Oh, it adds right to it. But that's a really good deal right there. Look at this. Look how stocked up Sam's is. Look at all the puffs right there with lotion and but look at all the paper towels right here look at it i mean all the way down here they're just piled high and uh holy smolies we i bought this the last trip here 1898 for these that's a good deal right here that's a bargain oh they even have look at portable generators up there my gosh i already have one but you need these in florida but look at the generators they have right there they don't have the prices. These are just overstock. Here's my wife's favorite water, 544 for the purified water. She really likes this, so that's not bad. 444 for this big container right here, so I need to make room in my cart. I got to get one. I don't know what the deal is with paper plates, but even 186 paper plates here, but these are ultras, $20, but $20 for these guys. I know they're nice, but still $20 for paper plates and here's the cheap plates here for 25 600 of them but they're just cheap you'd have to use three or four of them really the prices have gone up on everything look at the, even at Sam's on paper plates you just have to know what to buy and here's China paper plates 165 for 2198 and it looks like they've been selling these it looks like they've been selling the China I mean these are really tough plates if you're in the paper plates, but $21 for 100 and 165 of the guys. Now here's their foil not on sale. Last time I did it, it was it was five dollars off, $19.78, and you get 500 square foot. We bought it on sale. We bought it when it was a real bargain, $17.98. But if you went to another store, this stuff would be almost double. This all the Ziplocs are on sale. One gallon Ziploc storage bags. Look at you get. 208 of them in here for $16, regular $18.98. Remember the price we saw even at Target was expensive. And the quartz Ziplocs, look at this. 
you get 216 of these freezer bags, $12. That's a bargain right there, no doubt about it. Sandwich bags, we don't really use those. We switch right over to the freezer bags. It's only a dollar, dollar difference, but look at you get 580 for $11.23. Well, I tell you, Sam's is the place to shop. Now, here's these Cliff Bars. These are really good for uh, protein right here. 12 of these, 24 energy bars. I know they're pricey, but this is still a good price for Cliff Bar. They're really good, $23 though. And if you're into the Pop-Tarts, <laughs> $10 for just the Pop-Tarts. I grew up with those things. I don't know what they're made of, but uh, you know, they're not too bad. What else do we have here? Rice Krispies treats, oh yeah, these are always good. $9.58 for these things. They're good for lunches, you know. I grew up on these as a kid. Like I said, that and the Pop-Tarts. And these uh, Quaker Chewy Bars are really good, 1032 for this. And look at this, you get three pounds, two ounces of these. I really like these. These are really good just for snacks. I like those. Look at, and look how many they have. Look at that, all these, all these snacks, they're all bargains. You buy it in bulk at Sam's and you save money. It's the only way to go. I mean, with this economy, uh, we're just getting, we're just getting, um, jabbed with prices it's just horrible i can't stand it when i saw oreo cookies look at this nature valley 1498 when i saw oreo cookies for six dollars for 14 ounces six dollars and 16 cents i said that's insane and these are really good almost 50 of these 1148 for these crunchy look at this four pounds nine ounces for this box and these are really good oats and honey look at this all of this this big box four pounds for 11 48 and look how many they have I call this a bargain right here 11 11 48 and you get almost 50 of these it's over four pounds of snacks right here and these are actually healthy for you so I mean this is how you have to shop you have to shop in bulk if you want to save money you don't come to the bulk stores you go to those uh those fancy supermarkets you're not going to save money if you've never had these Belvitas right here the, look at 11.96, 9.96, scan and go, scan and go. So you scan it and go. Oh, I gotta, I gotta hook that up. I don't have it on my phone, but look at this. 25 packs of four. Once you start eating these guys, you can't stop. Look at this. Almost three pounds for this box, and these are really good. Like I said, once you try them, you'll, you'll be hooked on these guys. Now here's another thing I wanted to point out, these bath towels, members mark $6.98, this is what we buy, and that's what we use, and these are really big, really nice towels, and they really hold up, and I'm going to get two of them, because we only have about four left, I used to take them out fishing, and they're hotel type quality towels, see these, oversized bath towel, 30 by 58 really nice really nice quality I won't undo it because people complain me taking the towels apart but that's a really good bargain $6.98 for these towels they even have the hand towels $3.98 and these are really quality towels you can see this right here I mean you can go to Walmart and get cheap towels but these are really good I like the stuff this is where I've always gotten all my bath towels is right here at Sam's I got two of them here good good deal right there Jif Creamy Peanut Butter 2-Pack, 48 ounces, $8.12 compared to what you'd pay at a supermarket. My gosh, that's a bargain there. Creamy Peanut Butter and then the Extra Crunchy, my favorite right here. $10.82 if you want the Extra Crunchy right there. Oh man, and look at this. There's no shortage of the peanut butter, but this is on sale. $8.12 for two of these. That's a bargain right there. I mean, why go to the uh, supermarkets or even Walmart? Could you imagine what this would be at another store? Oh my gosh. Two big containers, a creamy Jif, $8.12. This, this is one heck of a bargain here. Look at how much you get. I mean, why go to the other stores when you can get a deal like this? I mean, this is how we have to save money. I mean, I'm tired of going to the expensive stores and buying stuff because things are just getting crazy. This is the way to shop. I mean, $8. Holy cow. Holy smolies. <laughs> well, that was our shopping adventure here at Sam's. I hope everybody enjoyed the show. And uh, we're going to be shopping for bargains from now on. I mean, that's the way to do it. We have to save money heading into uh, 2023. So anyways, give me a thumbs up for like. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Until next time, this is Scott with The Real Akani. 
This is Scott with The Real Economy. Happy New Year.